Hello everybody, Russian Batman back with another video, and in today's video, I'm doing a little uh, Amiibo showcase, and more specifically, I am doing Amiibos of um, people I know, or people's uh, sig figs, I guess, signature characters, whatever, whatever you want to call them. Uh, I have done one in the past, which I'll show off, actually no, I've done a few of uh potato mean which you should definitely go check out his channel uh, this is the main one i've done and i've shown him off in other videos in more length but it's basically just a modified version of um the tears of the kingdom link just made to be potato mean because potato mean also has a weird arm going on and i thought this would work well so that's why i made that and in that same vein, I was also inspired to make this uh, next figure here, which is, uh, this is the Ty the Movie Guy. Uh, me, let me show this. Ty the Movie Guy. Uh, he also goes by, he used to go by Canadian Meme Dealer. He has a movie channel and he makes some great stuff. And the reason I made it is because, well, Ty the Movie Guy, Sig Fig uses this kind of big red jacket. And I had this Joker Amiibo, and I thought it would look great. So I gave him this big jacket. I, this Actually, originally, I painted this to look like the Joker from, you know, Batman. Uh, but then I recently changed it. So, like I said, it could be Ty. I also did change his, uh, his like, glasses thing to be uh, to reflect um, 3D glasses, because that's what his character wears. His character also has one of those Canadian hats. Now, I decided to make him holding the hat. I thought it'd be cool because he yeah, has his hand there and it kind of looks like he's, you know, could be holding something. So that's what I did instead of just putting the hat on top of the head. He just had, I kept the knife there because I, I didn't bother getting rid of it. Maybe I should have. And then I also did change up the, um, this little bit to kind of look more like ice. I had some white tips to it and some some dry brushing. I did that because, well, he calls himself Canadian Meme Diller, and Canada is very cold and icy. Uh, that was the logic there. And then, yep, and then he has the black legs, white inner shirt. I did not, he usually has a little Canadian uh, maple leaf on his shirt, but I was not able to paint that detail in there because it, it would be difficult. So, yeah, that is really it. And it's like mostly just a simple paint job, except for I made that hat by scratch. Um, and yeah, so there is, I kind of like him from that angle. There's that, uh, Ty, the movie guy, or Canadian movie dealer, go subscribe to him. Uh, there'll probably be a link in the description if I remember to do that. And when I did mention to, originally this video was just going to be the Ty, the movie guy. However, last minute, kind of last minute, I decided to make one for Frail Whale, because Frail Whale has been asking me over and over to make him. And I mean, well, not not that much. But every time I mention I'm making a tie, it's like, well, make one for me. You made one for Potato Mean and, you know, uh, the Potato Mean and this other guy. So I'm like, okay, fine. I'll make you one. And then here it is. Here is my Frail Whale Amiibo I made. Now, the reason why Frail is a bit tough is because I did not have an obvious base I could use for Frail. A lot of these Amiibos, I don't obviously make them from scratch. I take an existing Amiibo and I modify it to kind of be what I want and I didn't really have one that would be good for frail until I found um this figure I, I might show a picture of what the original figure was but it was one of those collectible kind of characters um and that you'd find like at a GameStop or like a Hot Topic or something and I got it like a while ago and I've had it forever and so I decided to modify it to make it frail because well frail's kind of channel icon is very cartoony and I thought it'd fit with a big head and then uh, it kind of has like two big eyes. So I thought it would fit pretty well. Uh, and like I said, I went with this more cartoony design because, well, I think just Frail, just kind of, you know, his character's pretty cartoonish. He's, he has no mouth. It's just two big black eyes. And um, yeah, I kind of based this design off of a Sig Fig. I actually, where is it? Oh, I kind of based it off of this Sig Fig I made of him. Where he uses the blue pants, the red jacket, and uh, yeah, the only thing that's kind of inaccurate is definitely the hair is inaccurate to how a sick fig usually looks. However, I was not about to redo the figure's hair. I did not want to do that. And also, uh, it's kind of like a Giga Chad hair, and we all know Frail is secretly a Giga Chad. So yeah, he also has the F on his uh, headphone, which is seen in his sick fig design. 
and uh, yeah, white shoes with the uh, orange trims, and then also the the white stripes going on his jacket. I don't know if that's accurate if he has a jacket like that or not, but that's how this sig fig looks, and it uses the Miguel um, jacket. And then this amiibo base is actually 3D printed. I cheated. I did not. So 0% of this is actual amiibo. I 3D printed it. And yeah, I got the model off Thingiverse. And it was a model for um, the Mario Serial. You're meant to take the Mario Serial QR and put it into this amiibo base. This amiibo base actually does allow room to put a QR in there. I did not. Because um, I, I don't know what... I think I'd probably use a Mii Brawler, but I don't have a Mii Brawler QR. So, uh, yeah. But it looks actually... For a 3D printed thing, it looks fairly decent. If I put it next to this one, it's about the same size. And I think from a distance, you kind of... It, you I would mistake it for an actual Amiibo. So, yeah. Oh, uh, one more thing. I just wanted to upstage for real, real quick. I have an albino crocodile. He's pretty cool. I made a normal crocodile, but I gave it away, and I made this albino one. This is just a model off Thingiverse I thought was very funny. Uh, maybe I'll make some more. I don't know. Let me know if you want to see a full video of just crocodile, of fat crocodiles. Um, but, yeah, I've been 3D printing quite a bit recently. Uh, mostly just fat cro I love this fat crocodile, man. He's he's maybe 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 I'll just redo this whole video, and it'll just be about fat, fat crocodile. I don't know. Um, but, and also I think, uh, my brother, this joke, he was telling me I should replace my King K rule amiibo with this, just, you know, put him on there and just have this with a crown. That would be hilarious. All right. Uh, y'all enjoy the rest of your day. Go watch the 2000 film Rango. Go subscribe to Ty the Movie Guy and Frawell. They are both great. Uh, Ty the Movie Guy is currently making great movie content and Frawell needs to get, start releasing videos again. Your, your videos are great. Um, yeah, yeah, but I don't know what else to tell you, man. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah.